Good day. There are matters of concern that have risen in the media that we wish to respond to. Recently, Honorable Mao Sampa, a member of the Central Committee and a member of Parliament for Matero, has taken the party to court. He's challenging the decision to suspend him for a period of six weeks. Therein, he has also raised concerns around the leadership of our acting president, Honorable Given Luwinda, and our acting secretary general, Honorable Nixon Chilangwa. These two already hold substantive position of vice president and deputy secretary general of the party. In his contention and in an expert order that we wish to express concern that Mr. Sampa has now lifted these arguments and he has taken them to public gallery, to the media. He has even take, taken similar arguments to the registrar of societies. This is contemptuous to the court process that is before court. It is disregarding the court process to take matters that are before court. You take them to public gallery and thereby inviting us to respond to, this, to these matters. We have expressed and restrained ourselves from discussing a matter that is in court to, them, to take it to public gallery. We think that will be disregarding, I think, the respect that uh, the court attracts and the wisdom of the court to attend to the concerns that Honorable Mao Sampa has brought and then for us to argue and to be resolved amicably. As a party, there is no destabilization whatsoever. The party is intact, the leadership is intact. Honorable Given Lubinda remains our vice president. Honorable Nixon Chilangwa remains our deputy secretary general and we have a national chairperson if the party wishes to have even a central committee today it can have we are on a plan a solid plan to rebrand ourselves it is for this reason that even honorable mao sampa was brought to the central committee for this reason that myself Emmanuel mwamba and others honorable chimbakambwili dr uh, 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 Kanishas Banda and others were brought to the Central Committee to attempt to rebuild and rebrand the party. The party will not take kindly to anyone that wishes to destabilize it. We will fight because we think that this is a fight for Zambians. It's not an individual fight. Zambians recognize that the Patriotic Front is a legitimate opposition party and they have a lot of goodwill around the party. They want it to succeed, that we can provide checks and balances for the party, for the new Dawn government. We can be an alternative to the new government. So we will not allow any individual to destabilize the process that Zambians have embarked on. On issues on the status of the former president, Honorable Nixon Chilangwa, and the issue around the acting president, Honorable Given Lubinda, these matters will be argued in court. We cannot bring them to public gallery. It will be disrepute to the court, it will be disregarding the court and will be acting contemptuously to the court. Our appeal is to Honorable Mao Sampa to desist from discussing matters that he has taken to court, to thrust them in public gallery, thrust them in the media, take them to the registrar of societies, the very matters he wants the court to determine. So with those uh, few words, thank you very much. And we, 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 we have received a lot of calls of encouragement. People even offering to mediate between ourselves and Honorable Mao Sampa. A lot of people have raised concerns and we are very appreciative of the views you hold about the party, how you wish the party to build itself after it lost elections in 2021. So thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your words of affirmations, of strength and your words of encouragement. The party is determined to make the PF the strongest opposition party, a party that can take over leadership in 2026. So God bless you and thank you very much.